Atlas Fallen is out now, and today we are checking it out. First impressions was provided a key for this game from Focus Entertainment, so thank you to them for that. This game is actually by the same developers that did the Surge 1 and 2. I know race that came by, it seems, and she's hoping that somebody awakens. I don't know if we are part of that. Where, where am I? What am I? What is it? This light. It calls me. What is that? Oh. So we are playing as this thing? This person? This... I don't know. Look up at the watcher. Invert camera. Oh, no. I do not want to invert the camera. We terrify. Attack, send secondary attack, and evade. I like that whip attack. There's one. Combat feels pretty clean so far. No. Someone is trying to keep me. Alright, that's Wait, that looks pretty sick. Is, I have been here repeating. No, no. You cannot escape. No. I will not go back! You, can you help me? The voice. Who are, Who are you? Okay, here we go. We got some character customization here. Let's see. Alright, that looks good. Works for me. Confirm character. Looking for survivors, but I only found you. We're coming back for me. I was in this. <laughs> We're exposed out here. Tutorial we dream. Need to get back to camp. This kind of reminds me a little bit of like Outriders. But just in a sandy desert and a lot a lot more melee rather than uh shooting costs if we fight we could win but the cost will be steep so i say we take our demands to the true culprit morath yes yes we have no other option brothers morath he can't escape justice he will be judged he is and he will be judged whatever happens the most important thing so if we agree let's get through the night yes together together so we're going after morath he's the the leader of the caravan i guess he's watching the plot hmm. you what are those workers doing I, I don't know of course you don't captain morath i uh, be silent i shall see for myself Captain Mora, may the sun light your way. Can I? No. Back to work. All of the loss is what? Have you seen the mess we're in? No laws against having conversation. We weren't doing. Yeah, actually, let's not say any that. Let's say we weren't doing anything wrong. We aren't doing anything wrong. You dare. You dare to. We need you to listen to us now, or we'll all die. We run this camp, you need us. Ooh, yeah. We run this camp, whether you admit it or not. You need us. Choose your next words extremely carefully, unnamed. I've run men through far less. Work together, yeah. The raids will overwhelm us all if we don't work together. But we aren't going to die for you. You all think this is easy, don't you? Be careful. That's the problem. People like you, overwhelmed by savage self-preservation. I did not ask for this. I challenged us to survive in this storm. Our god is what, and this charade puts us all at risk. You dare talk back to me, then you'll be perfect for a task I have in mind. Captain, you have to listen to us. Silence. One of your kind stole something from me and ran into the waste. Find it we may reach and it is death out there our people needs it if it helps our people i will do it <laughs> i thought you said debate oh god find the thief is this where Don't come back we awaken that thief. find the thief hey thanks for the rose saucy oh There's god someone up there something else come it's gonna get taken by the wraith closer what the voice. is this i am here what is that yes i feel you something's calm <sighs> no at last, I see again. Where no are time. you? Wraith! Oh no. No, 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 no. Concentrate. Use my strength. I will <laughs> aid you. You know what's funny? Forsaken came out earlier this year. Um, and that had a talking gauntlet. Use the gauntlet. 
Oh my god, and this game has a talking gauntlet too. That's funny. And they're both like sandy environments. What just happened? My body moved on its own. And these weapons. Together we are strong. strong. Who are you? Who are you? Remember. How do we survive? I defeated a wraith. We defeated that wraith. I never thought someone would hear my voice again. Okay, let's find someplace safer. Essence Dust. You gain Essence Dust uh, is gained from defeating foes and progressing quests. Okay, so it's like the experience, I guess. Running pretty fast now. So that thing that we defeated was a, uh, a wraith. You can generate momentum by hitting and defeating foes. Momentum increases damage you're dealt, but also damage you receive. Interesting. Momentum is temporary. If you don't hit foes, your momentum will fade after a short while. The gauntlet calls the sand. But I'm guessing the more momentum you have, there's probably abilities you can hit or use at a certain tier. Okay. Combat feels smooth so far. It's a little bit slow, but I think we're we're probably gonna get some stuff that speeds it up a bit. When you generate enough momentum, your uh, weapons grow in size and power, and your move set transform transforms. This is known as ascending. Okay. When you keep up the momentum. The energy released by the gauntlet grows. Be careful. As momentum is a double-edged blade. Stronger. You can the tell when they're gonna attack harness. too. They like light up a little red. There is something attached to the gauntlet. It's an idol. You can use it to heal your wound. I uh, can heal yourself by pressing the idol with R. Weapon hits restore the idol's energy, which is enough energy to restore. The idol regains one of its charges. But that one I couldn't see. It's weird. That one I couldn't see either. Okay. Find the thief. It's another thing. We got 150 tributes. Recruit garments. Wait, is that what I have right now? Oh wait, no, that's what we can buy. For 75, I guess. Recruit garments, modest protective garments made of moose uh, leather sewn by unnamed for the caravan supervisor. It's the drifter. So I don't know. Wait, can I? You ready to fight? Is it good? The, the combat you, feels interesting so far. Um, kind of getting some first impressions still. We're we're still trying to figure out what exactly is going on. Uh, it's a lot of tutorials so far. You. And I'm about 30 Return minutes in, but it is co-op, so you can do all this. Like with Pathetic. another player, pretty much. I should have expected as much from one of your kind. When will you learn? You are unnamed for a reason, and no one will ever notice. One more dead unnamed. Return to me. Oh God. Where am I? Yo, what's up, Master here? Sandwich? I was. Why did you leave me? I did. Yes, I'm alive. You were taken by Morath. Thank you. We're coming back. Now, Loker, powerful wraith encountered. Here we Watch. go. I can protect you. Sandskin, press Q to activate Sandskin to parry incoming attacks. A red flash appears before attacks, indicating the ideal timing to use your Sandskin. Uh, okay, so it's like a parry. Okay, yeah, it literally is parry. <laughs> See? My sand skin will leave them crystallized, but it will not last long. All right, that feels kind of cool. <laughs> we got three parries all at once. Bloker defeated. Okay. Yeah, we're all remember his powers. The whip and the sword, oppression and rebellion. The sand whip shapes the sand into weapons, both oppressed and their oppressor, to restore balance. Weapon menu. This menu allows you to assign weapons of types uh, for main and secondary. This includes the types. Okay, cool. Assign the sand whip as a secondary weapon by right clicking. Got it. I see. Looks like we have armor types. So that's what we are wearing earlier. Ah. Nice. 
So there's like a momentum bar which you can kind of see on TikTok. But pretty much when that bar fills up all the way, right now we're at the first level. Uh, you take more damage, but at the same time, you do more damage, and your weapons that you have equipped get larger. So the the style of how you you fight and attack changes a little bit. And once you hit the highest level, which is like tier three, I guess, then they're as big as they're gonna get, and you do the most damage with your weapons, which is an interesting way of doing it. The Watcher. That was from. It's coming this way. That was in his dream too. Give me the rub. It's not for the likes of you. Oh, it was it, it was such a good time. The lost Master. It, it was so good. good. You have stirred enough trouble. I will Captain! It's the Queen! We need to leave. Are we uh, about to glide on the sand now? The sand is under our control. It carries us. You better know what you're doing. Uh, that's pretty sick. Yes, I don't. Doing fine. This is fine. Familiar. Yes. Let's find these knights then. Before we oh. reach the capital, preferably. There is a passage ahead. You mean a hole? Wait! What? Trust me. Oh. Okay, we're putting a lot of trust into this man. A whole lot of trust. Increase your damage. Equip. Okay, here we go. Essence stone. This menu contains your acquired essence stones, provide you with powers and your effects in combat. Okay, so that's one of them. So I'm guessing equip the essence stones to the matching socket with the bronze in order for it to, uh, for that. The symbol below is the essence stone uh, shows its rank. The amount of symbols indicating how strong the essence stone are and allows you to compare them. You can increase the rank of an essence stone by upgrading it. It requires specific plants and minerals as well as amount of essence dust that make and now it makes sense now it makes sense so there's tier one two and three yeah so that's the tiers of momentum that you build and i'm guessing there's probably like an ultimate for each tier that you can get can you feel it it's the response to momentum god i need to change the uh the dodge key binds. I need to put it on my. This week I'll be playing Remnant 2, probably co op with my buddy. And we'll be taking it there from there. Uh, hurl a hammer at your target, which can travel back to you, damaging everything in its path. That one I like. Uh, you now have obtained an active essence stone, which you can recognize by the diamond shape. An active essence or uh, active stones provide you with attacks and abilities in combat. So that one goes up here. Okay. <laughs> So this is the anvil. Do you use the anvil to craft weapons? What? Uh, Stop! Stay back! I... So that was Wait, him in you... the dream. The voice in my head? Yes. This device allows me to project myself, but not move. I am Niall. Yes, Niall. You already told me that. But all of this? Tell me what is happening. What even are you? I am a spirit, I guess. Sorry, my memory still is... Un Wait. Ruin Rising Pack. Oh. Been added to my inventory? Increase your defense. That actually looks pretty sick. Increase the chance to trigger this effect. Your weapon hits against slowed foes. I uh, have a small chance to crystallize. We also got this. Leave a proximity mine. Oh, it goes in that first one. Leave a proximity mine behind, which damages and significantly f slows foes for six seconds on detonation. I kind of want to try that. So you can kind of tell which ones are combo with each other because the purple ones are slow. The red ones are damage. This one increases our defense. The green one is for like health items, I guess. Find a piece to stabilize the gauntlet. Uh, 
I don't know if this is a good idea. I guess it wasn't. Fiery leaves. What's going on? Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, hey! Wake up! Wake up! It's time to wake come up. Come on! Come on! Wait, is that the traveling? Uh... Oh shit! Uh, uh, I mean, <clears throat> thank Philos. <laughs> Your. Uh... He was trying to steal the gauntlet. End him. Back off! I was merely attempting to revive you. You put on quite the show. Your face is familiar. So I'm guessing. Uh, I'm assuming there's multiple areas because when you press the, Let's meet at the village or when later. you go to the anvil, we'll it says we're in the forgotten something, the forgotten sands. I don't think I like this man. At least he's given us information. If the knights are behind that gate, can we unearth it? So I'm assuming there's you more places that head. you can go to, and not just this. Do you this. remember what just happened? The gauntlet is unstable, and not only that. It is incomplete. You have a plan? Yet? Can it be fixed? Trust is complicated, I see. But yes, we can fix the gauntlet. Remember the vision and the gauntlet's explosion? Its pieces were scattered across the land. If we get them back, we can reforge the gauntlet bit by bit, getting new powers along the way and preventing further explosions. Great. How can we find them then? I sense a pop. Find a piece to stabilize the gauntlet. I see Immortals of Avium? Yeah, us. I can kind of see that too because it, it has like to be a by some magic. spell vibe to it oh god when you go up a bunch of mul like multiple enemies at once. Because right now we've been only getting like two or three enemies. much we need to go to each one of these i will say the world looks pretty like bright and pretty <laughs> uh so that that's kind of cool and if there's multiple environments then uh, i think I that's also a, a good now. thing that's a relief yeah straight to the one over there yeah if we see some uh some monsters we'll uh we'll try fighting them what happened like right here Oh god. There. Is that your sprint? Yeah, that's the uh the sprint ability. I don't know where that thing went. Kind of just disappeared. What is that? Shell basher level 2. There's something here. Some tributes. Wow, that was actually a good amount. We got 850 tributes from that. One through ten, what are you thinking? Um, I think it's like a so far, like a solid seven-ish. We'll see where it goes. Oh god, dude, I can't get out of this. The difficulty scale just like <laughs> <laughs> it just came out of nowhere. Holy crap, dude. Maybe it's because I'm just not the, uh... Oh. I did read in the, like, patch notes or whatever that apparently battles are a little bit harder than they should be or might be right now, so... That's a thing, but maybe I just need to get good. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's give that another try. Or honestly, I don't know if we need to fight that thing because it shows it's in the red. So I'm not leveled for it. Seven uh, remake for the first time. That's awesome. I hope you uh, you enjoy that, man. It's uh, it's definitely a good time.
Here we go. The Purger's War Suit. Yeah, it's way better than what I currently have. Let's go ahead and equip that. Nice. Can toggle the helmet on and off. Cosmetic. What is that? Oh my god, that is a giant shield on your chest. Does it just sit there? That doesn't even... I don't know about that. <laughs> that looks so weird. I mean, I see what it... Maybe it's just this thing. This is... It says it's black dye. That looks like green. Huh? Maybe it looks different outside. Yeah, that looks green. <laughs> one on like this slam attack de uh leaves behind a damaging area of effect for five seconds or this one might honestly switch back to this and even upgrade it dude that sound effect is identical to the assassin's creed one when you get hit send out an explosion for all nearby foes yeah i think we should do that That'll be worth having. Restore a high amount of your idol's energy over the next six seconds. Okay. I'm not choosing red, who are you? I know, I thought about, okay, this looks a little bit more black now, I guess. Maybe it's just like the sand. Momentum generates so slow, it's Let tough. Wraith return to dust and shatter it. There we go. Yo, Jamie, thank you for the uh for the gift there. Thank you, thank you. that sound effect at the end i think that sounds pretty sick something here stay on your guard there's something here i'm not sure if this is where the anvil was this though is it, the major piece we need to unearth the enhanced gate. raise piece now we just need more shards and we can forge it uh now we need to find more shards i knew it i knew it Oh God, what happens if we can't get out of it or we can't fight this? Oh no, oh no. I'm like right there. Are you? No! Oh my God. I was literally right there. Classic moment, man. When your health, when the health is at like two or three more hits and you die. I, uh, Doing momentum three is crazy. Oh, oh my God. All right, that Beautiful. guy, a fine what the hell? 
All right, maybe we shouldn't far. just use our abilities this as battle. early. I remember something. We can use the sand in another way. Cut your arms and... Knuckle dust. Sometimes we have to defend ourselves with bare hands. Knuckle dust shapes your hands into iron fists capable of taking down even the biggest of foes with the right skills. So there's a new weapon that we can do or use. Crystalline knuckle. Hits it with a fully charged attack and a knuckle dust. Have a moderate chance to crystallize your foes. It's actually kind of cool. But where's the, uh, I really don't know where the altar is though. An anvil must be nearby. The gauntlet resonates with it. It says an anvil must be nearby, but I really don't see one. 10 seconds. There's a lot of abilities that, that say you and your ally. So I'm assuming that the game probably wants you to play co-op a good amount. Perform an attack that interrupts all foes hit. What, uh, what tier is this? This one. Store a high amount of your idol when you're below that. Increase your damage. What's this one? Uh, hits with a fully charged attack of the knuckle duster have a moderate chance to crystallize your foes. Oh, you can change your presets. Oh, that's pretty cool too. View upgrades. Yeah, we should upgrade this armor. One thing I didn't even do. This game is pretty cool. Um, thank you again to Focus Entertainment for providing me a key. I, I actually enjoyed it, and I think we're going to return to it this weekend. Um, we have a few other games that we're currently playing, like Baldur's Gate 3, which I'm going to play uh, shortly here. Is going to be it. If you guys enjoyed the stream, definitely go to a YouTube video, leave a like on that. You can watch the beginning, any other parts, or any other series I've done. We'll be back in a little bit, and we'll play some more, uh, more Baldur's Gate. So have a good one. See you all in a little bit. Peace.